Hey right, guys, how's it going? Uh, been going okay for me. Uh, had to work a little bit there Monday morning and finish up that RV. Um, and then Tuesday I had the day off, so Tuesday I was like, I want to wash the van. So, scrubbed it with the scrub brush and then hand, used the hand mitt too. Uh, cleaned up the tires. I got tire dressing on the chrome, but they look good, a lot better from a distance. But I bought some chrome paint today. At some point, I'm going to try and do from this edge. Um, well, maybe this one I'll just do it. I don't know, that's not going to look right. It'd be easier just to tape it off right there. Uh, Recall it with that chrome spray paint. But, uh, um, been having problems with this window. I think the motor is about to go out. It, if I put it all the way down to the bottom, it doesn't want to go up. It'll go like halfway down and I can go up and down with it. But, um, and then after I washed it, you know, I had a bunch of, I still got my deer hunting trailer in here, but all it was full of cardboard and leaves and oh, everything's so tight. It's hard to open and close these. You need to lube them up a little bit, but uh, I vacuumed it out really good. And it's got some dirt, you know, again, but pretty much the van inside. Uh, and then Kevin, he cleaned the glass quick and wiped out the door jams kind of quick. And Kevin did a bunch of extra early. He wiped down the dash and stuff too, but didn't really do that good of a job. <laughs> I kind of wish, kind of wish he would have maybe just left that. But yeah, I mean this room's really bad. And I cleaned them up last year, but sitting over the winter, they just got really bad. But, uh, the carpet was ripped out from last year. I started cutting up, ripping it up because I ripped up the carpet out of the front. So I bought a tiny light today, 41 bucks or so, 40 something. Had to buy more cleaning solution, glass cleaner, wax, cheap wax applicator pads. Always spend there 75 bucks. And I had to buy a new flashlight. I don't really have a good one here at the shop. And, uh, some Gorilla Tape. This stuff works really good for mildew stains, stuff like that. Uh, that's some new stuff I'm going to try, water spot remover. Try it on the glass on those RVs. And this is uh, stuff I use on fiberglass boats. It works pretty good. Um, and dupla color chrome paint. So, and then two, two pump sprayers, 20 bucks it was on sale, 20 bucks for two of them, two gallons each, I'm thinking. So, and, uh, oh, I started, uh, you know, taking the stuff off and I was like, I should uh, should record it, you know, some of you guys, uh, the joys of, you know, owning a van, I mean, they're not easy to work on, <laughs> as you can see from my last year's videos, my hands aren't cut up yet, so, but they will be, but I, I'm going to try and uh, replace that vacuum advance, oh my lord. I gotta find those parts. I think this is it, 
Yo. I think that's what it's called. But, uh, the one that's on there. God dang it. There we go. The one that's on there, like half of that thing's gone, rusted off. The holes will barely even sit on there. So, I thought I had a hose I pack up in here too, but that might be in the other box. But I'll mess with that later. But, um, yeah. So, taking the dog hose off. Everything's pretty good. I'm booked up until the 7th or the 8th of May. Um, I got an RV wash and wax. Or wait, what do I got coming in next? I was supposed to have a gold detail with a full shampoo today, but they didn't show up. And, uh, so that's why I figured I'd be doing this. Let's see, we'll just light the seat. And, uh. Oh, that one's. That one just come out by hand. Um. Then I got. Oh, I got a motorcycle drop off today at 5 ish. The one I did that Black Ford Explorer. I think I shared that album on the Facebook page. Um. She's supposed to be bringing me her, her bike. Ow, ow, ow. And then, uh... And then, uh, I'm doing this guy, Andy, uh, I, I've done his truck for a couple of years, and, uh, I'm gonna do his wife's car. I think Saturday, unless that's next Saturday. But, uh, yeah. I can't remember if I had to, I think I gotta move the driver. as far back as it'll go. Take it all the way off. 
can just do that. This probably isn't even hooked up. I don't know, it's supposed to be routed down there, I think. But, uh, it's been running good. It's still kind of doing the idle and high and idle and low, and I'm pretty sure it's because of that. So, uh, oh shoot. I don't know, maybe I will get this out. I think I'll have to spin the chair or something. Well, I'll just come back later. Well, uh, talk to you guys later.